Hello, ladies and gentlemen of the humble internet. I welcome you back to Ryman's Bizarre Adventures in Kato Shoujo. With you is your humble host, as always, Ryan, a.k.a. Ryman. And you guys know the rules. When Ryan's tired, Ryan gets lazy. When Ryan gets lady... Ladies, <laughs> no. When Ryan gets lazy, it results in one of two things. Either I make a short little quickie based on a little sketch that's going on in my head, or some other random event I just happen to have recorded. Or you get a visual novel playthrough. Both of which are incredibly easy for me to edit. With that being said, last time we were here, we were still in fucking Act 2. But it's gotta be getting close to the end. If I remember correctly, looking away from the screens, without looking... Without, without looking... Off the top of my head, I think we're gonna get to the point where... Where I forget. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 wait. I think we're going to that spot that Rin was talking about how, uh, how we can see things. I am fucking terrible at describing anything. We were going to the place to see the thing. Get it? Got it? Good. Together we walked downstairs and then outside. The usual summer day. Wearing, uh... Uh, cicadas and all greet us it's immensely hot and without the air conditioning the classrooms offer I start sweating immediately be a fucking man Hisao we start along the tree line pathway that leads towards the dorms the cherry trees offer shade with the sunlight blinking through the holes in the canopy the light creates a chaotic pattern of shadows dappled with bright places where the beams hit the pavement Rin's eyes are wandering in every direction but mine. I get the feeling that it's intentional. She leads me to a back to the back gate again, taking us through it and into the forest beyond. As before, the dropping temperature and the drastically decreased levels of light make it feel like the forest is swallowing us into its con uh, cavernous belly. We head uphill along the same path as last time, snaking around the trees and boulders, over roots and rocks, past wild undergrowth. Birds sing somewhere in the woods. The birds of peace signaling that the... <laughs> the onslaught of battle has subsided, at least for now. <laughs> Ryan, why are you clapping? I'm clapping because I never thought I'd see the day where I'd somehow cross-reference World War II Online with Cattle of Fucking Shoujo. Let's fucking go. <laughs> God, I should probably make a series of t-shirts based on a lot of the dumb crap I say. Birds of Peace is probably going to have to be one of them. <laughs> What are a couple other uh, shirt ideas I could probably go out? I don't think I can get away with the bang bus. I I I I I I I I don't think I can get away with the bang bus. But there's probably a bunch of other dumb things I've said or dumb events that have unfolded in the past that could probably turn into to hilarious merchandise. <laughs> Talking about fucking merchandise. I can't break 350 subscribers. I can't break 10 viewers per video. I'm gonna sell fucking merchandise. Dark Side Phil is selling merchandise successfully. <laughs> God damn it. We go past the small uh, clearing with the big maple that is now called the Worry Tree. <laughs> I almost forgot about the Worry Tree. <laughs> worry Tree didn't forget about you. The climb steepens, then becomes easier again. I have to stop a few times to catch my breath, then hurry after Rin, who doesn't stop to wait for me. Soon, I'm out of breath again. Suddenly, the trees end, and we emerge from the forest. The boundary of the woods is sharp and, and abrupt, as though a line had been drawn to mark it. As I shoot my head frantically over to my right, looking at my other screen, double checking to make sure I'm actually fucking recording. I am. <laughs> the hill continues to climb up a little further ahead, but from here to the top, it's a rocky meadow. Patches of grass and small bushes that look like they're growing straight from the rock. It's 
pretty new artwork. The lack of music, so you just take in the ambiance of nature in the background. It's actually kind of nice. It's one, of, it's one of those things where... It's one of those moments in games where I can just close my eyes, not literally do anything, and just suck in the noise. Hmm. I'll have to do that in my own t for downtime, though. Otherwise, this recording is going to be like two hours. <laughs> the city lies below and away, lazily revealing in a quiet afternoon mood. You can see pretty far from here, and the vista is beautiful. I wonder how high up we are. I breathe the fresh air and feel my heart rate slowly going back down. I think I might have overdone it a bit. A higher pulse is dangerous for me. I'm feeling fine right now, though. The wind picks up, ruffling my hair and causing the trees below to sweat me. It makes the grass un undulate in waves as the breeze sweeps across the hilltop. The sun shines from the open skies uh, upon us. A few clouds passing by to shadow it. What was painful heat before is now gentle water. I have a question! So Rin likes to come up here, right? It's a gorgeous view. You can see fucking everything. Does that mean in the last two seasons, it was a very good possibility that in any one of the shenanigans that I was unfolding, Rin was overwatching? Oh, God. Oh, God. Rin the Collector? More like Rin the fucking Watcher. I take a good look around. The hilltop is pretty in the way nature often is. Unplanned, harmony found in the natural arrangement of things. The most striking feature is the abundance of small yellow flowers. They're called weeds! Everywhere in this small meadow. I can't help commenting on it. Wow! A lot of flowers! That's a lot of weeds! You fucking idiot! If they're flowers, then I, I won't take it back. I have a philosophy on plants. A weed is a weed is a weed. Yeah. Do you know this kind? They will fly away. Yeah. Dandelions. Oh! You mean weeds?! There are not many of them at the school, because they cut the grass so often. Nobody cuts the grass up here. The fragile looking flowers will soon turn white and fluffy like cotton, and the wind will carry the seeds away. I crouch down to look at the weed! Silently basking in the sunlight, it's not a hint of white yet, so it's still waiting for its time to be fulfilled. I brush my fingers against the weed. Feel the soft texture in my fingertips. It feels nostalgic somehow. I hear Rin approaching from behind and stand up to face her. She has a weird look on her face. The birds of peace have fallen silent. That can only mean war is once again upon us. Something on your mind? I don't know. It's just... Whoa, wait, whoa, 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 wait, 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 slow, slow it down. Wait, slow it down. Wait, 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 wait. Stop. Stop. Stop, I gotta read this written. Hold, okay, let's go, let's fucking go. You just look so sad all the time and you become upset so easily. It makes me confused and I really don't remember much about yesterday except that you came to my room and that's why it might be because of me and if so, because of me, I think that's, uh, that I know why. It's because people don't really like talking to me and you might be the same and that you don't, and that you'd be sad and I know that people and I'm talking about others and, and then Emmy too is a... From the top, we can do it. Is this supposed to be one go? I'm gonna frantically look around for a fucking period. I don't think I see one. Oh! <laughs> I should have busted out drinks for this. 
you just look so sad all the time and become, and become obsessed so easily that it makes me confused and I really don't remember much about yesterday except that you came to my room and that's why it might be because of me that if it's still because of me I think that I know why. It's because people don't really like talking to me and you might be, be the same and that would be sad. I know that people and I'm talking about others than Emmy too always say hey, that I'm, I'm strange and I talk strange things so I don't though I thought I tried to, hey, not to say strange things but I, it just makes me think more new, new strange and, and colorful well, that I was not good word, word but maybe you understand anyway and I and I was, so if I want to say something I really don't know how and then the words are not like the, the same as the thoughts because something goes wrong on the way out because it's not like hey the thoughts are really the, the thing I, I should be saying it's more like the idea of the thought or the feeling or, 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 or the other idea or the of the idea or the idea of the feeling is what you know, really any of those because either because there's no word for it unless I invent a new one which is not really useful so I've been thinking of doing things is better than saying so maybe because yesterday I took those pills and I was feeling a little straight and I might have done something and I should have been something but I, I do something something that I should be said I don't even know whatever I know if I would have been any better because I was, uh, thought there was no tele telepathy <laughs> it's, uh, it's the real telepathy is there I just think it'd be t oh, it's, it's terrible and useful at the same time but right now I wouldn't mind because I'm misunderstanding it's, uh, you know, understanding and it's not that I thought holy fuck I love you is that did anyone did anyone did anyone get that did anyone get that because I didn't I just Sprinted my way through. I don't know what happened. I don't want to do it again. I want to do it again. I can't. I this I can't. Holy snaky! Think my pancreas is about to burst. I grasp her shoulder and squeeze hard to make her stop. I don't have the capacity to take all that at once. I couldn't even. Get through it. What happened? My brain. Rin shuts up instantly. Take a breath. You're gonna kill Ryan. <laughs> I'm not upset. Why would I be? I'm just a little confused, but it's all right. Please don't do that again. You will kill the host. I wonder if I was making a face that she that she doesn't like again. I guess I've been thinking about yesterday all the time. Maybe I looked weird. I wish I had a mirror with me all the t at, at all times. No one needs to get it all, all said at once. I'll listen, even if you talk slower. It, it just came out. Sorry. I'm okay now. I just wanted to say something. I didn't mean it that much. It's weird, isn't it? She looks at me with a surprisingly timid expression. I really like this piano. Oh, God. <laughs> One that I haven't seen before. I can't help but laugh a little. Yeah, it's weird. You are a pretty weird person, but there's nothing wrong with that. Have you met me? Thanks for being worried about me, but I'm going to get better. I told you that yesterday. But I guess you don't remember that either. I don't. I wonder what else I forgot. Hopefully nothing important like my own name. That'd be terrible. Well, you kinda kissed me. I did? Yeah, you did. On the lips! I try to sound as matter-of-fact as I can, but I worry that I might be blushing again. Did you kick me? No, 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 no. Feeling personally attacked again, but no. Shut up, Don. Shut up, Mark. Mark doesn't watch this. Shut up anyway. No. Why would I do that? Then it's all good, right? It's okay, right? I didn't forget my name. Yeah, it's okay. I wish I was more suave so that I could come up with a better follow-up to that. But nothing comes to mind. It's a good thing that Rin uh, has more her to say. It makes me feel relieved somehow. I think I should say sorry. I I'm really bad with people. You and me both, sister. Some things are hard to understand. Like jellyfish. Do you understand jellyfish? Not 
really? And I kind of understand what you're getting at. It's a thing that exists, but you're like, how the fuck does it exist? It's like me. How the fuck do I exist? How the fuck does any of this exist? I, I guess not. People are like jellyfish to me. I don't understand. I kind of get it. This is getting scary. <laughs> now it's her turn to make a face I, I, I don't really like seeing. I never really had any friends. What about me? Oh, that's one of the choices! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what about Emmy, too? Aren't we both your friends? Wait, I'm going with the thing I blurred out of my fucking mouth. What about me? Nah, I'm your friend for one. I mean, think about it. We already talk a lot to each other. We've gotten upset at each other and then forgiven the other for it. That's what they call... <clears throat> friendship. It's really nice of you to say that. I've always been able to tell everything to pencils and paints and paper. They are my best friends. That, uh, that, I'm sorry, that has to be coincidentally one of the saddest fucking things I've ever read in my entire life. And I've read my own biography. <laughs> it's harder with people. I have to use words. That's hard for me. It's hard for me too! With people. I have to be in the same room with them. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I know. You told me. About how you forget. Rin nods at me wordlessly, and I dare to attempt showing her a little encouraging smile. I if I do it properly. She doesn't reply in any way. I feel really glad. The distance Rin puts between herself and everything else has made me feel really uneasy ever since I met her. If we become real friends, I'm sure I can understand her more. I, I think we'd all like to understand Rin a little bit more at this point. Me, whenever, no matter where I am, wherever I, 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 wherever I may be, whatever I'm doing, if I start thinking about Rin, I'm like, it's like, I have to start piecing this together, and I start forming one of those charts or the, the or those grids, like strings attached from one picture or statement to the other, like, like things, Rin. My parents come down and say, Ryan, what the fuck are you doing? It's four o'clock. So like, I don't need sleep. I need answers. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure that this way we can close the gap of understanding between us. My thoughts don't transmit to Rin. She seems lost deep in thought, wandering amidst the sea of yellow flowers covering the grassy. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me reread that. Wandering amidst the sea of weeds covering the grassy hilltop. It's just as well. Time passes, the breeze making the tall grass sway gently in time with the wind. Rin hums a little song to herself so quietly I can't tell what it is. If it's even anything at all. A stronger gust of wind, uh, a, a stronger gust sweeps uh, over the hilltop, and the sound of the trees and the wind buries the song away. Check my watch. More out of habit. More out of flexing on, on Rin. <laughs> More than anything else. It's 4.30 right now. On this Saturday afternoon. We're 10 minutes late. For 4.20. Huh. Rin looks into the di distant horizon with that odd blank stare of hers. As if she were looking at nothing at all. Her pupils are dark and quiet like the pair of deep still ponds. You are going to become better, right? I hope so. Sure! Me too, you know? I'm going to talk to that friend of the teacher and ask her to put my stuff in her place and work hard to get all that done. Okay. 
I decided that just now, you know. But I think I knew it all along. I've had this feeling for a long time now. That I'm going to change. Even if I hate it and I don't want it. Even if I wanted to. I would change. Like, I am not enough that way. I, I, like, I am not enough the way I am. I think this could be a good way to do it because it's like straight lines. Like I've learned all the things in my life so far or, uh, just for this. It's just art. And it's the only thing I really know. I know what I'm going to do, so it's good. I'm not afraid at all. I feel like I always do. Is that weird? No. Not at all. Oh god, his sow, don't die now! I close my eyes and give in to the irresistible sensation that has been growing inside me all week long. I float up towards the surface of my own life. The pressure of being underwater slowly diminishes. The weightless sensation becomes stronger. I break the surface of the water, lifting my head into the sunlight and inhale deeply, breathing in fresh air as for the first time in a long, long while. My lungs fill with oxygen. It's usually what happens when you breathe! And I open my eyes to see Rin's peaceful, determined face. We walk down the slope carefully and slowly to avoid falling down. Rin in the lead and me a few steps behind. Rin surely can do this. Even if she can't, she's going to pull through. I'm sure that I can keep my head above water too, from now on. The sun sets behind our backs. Setting the world ablaze in its orange glow. You know, I, I always try to mimic that, you know, walking with the sun setting behind me. And whenever I can't get the sun to cooperate, I usually just set off napalm somewhere in the background. It acts as a setting sun. Should probably I'll just forget I set that. <laughs> I keep watching the back of the red-headed girl descending the path a few steps ahead of me. If it's only this much, the dis uh, this distance between us is definitely within my reach. Oh my goodness, we actually made it to Act 3. Is Rin cutting a jig? No. No, no, she is not. No, she is not. I am an idiot. I saw my boy Hisao over to the left. They were both in positions of famous sculptures. I have. Uh, uh... I asked you a question, Nikai! I, I think I'm gonna end it there on that bout of stupidity. We finally finished Act 2. We're moving things along. This stuff is usually in Acts a 4. So we're over halfway there. Oh my god. I think my brain is still recovering when it crashed from that wall of text. But hey, things are moving along swimmingly. Plot is happening. We're both, we're all going to get better. And I'm going to save things here and get the fuck out of Dodge. If you guys enjoyed anything you saw here, you know that drill. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Take a, br a browse around the library. You might find a series of adventures you, you would gravitate towards. Up on that Facebook and Discord. And as always, stay awesome out there, people. Adios.